my name is Pat Cohen White. I studied at the Royal College of Art, uh, printmaking, and I'm based in Birmingham. I think a lot of my work extends back to my printmaking days. Um, with printmaking, you are faced with these set of uh, boundaries, these set of rules that you have to abide by. But within that, um, because you have substances to play with and materials which behave how they like, that gives um, these rules, these constraints, a certain freedom for you to play around with. So this kind of tension between um, um, being constrained by these rules and finding a sense of freedom within that, I think that still exists in, in, in how I practice my work. I'm very interested in, in phenomena. I'm interested in um, bodies cosmological bodies, geological bodies. A lot of my work is about finding some kind of relationship with them. And making a work is about entering some kind of relation with these things. I'm making these works which came out from this book published by NASA, which details all the solar eclipses over 5,000 years. So I'm using each path of shadow of the solar eclipse as the first line for each of my drawings. And what arises are these kind of organic looking organism type things. And I'm hoping to animate these drawings. In the NASA publication, there's 11,898 diagrams. And I've made about 1,200 so far. So it is kind of like a life's work, really, making these drawings. I really like drawing because it's a shared practice. You know, it's not, it's not just artists who, who make drawings. And I think that gives it real significance. So it's something which is um, innate within us, I think. So growing out from that um, are two bodies of other work which relate to it. One is called uh, Primal Scenes, which is a series of photographs where I'm going around different sites in Wakefield and I'm carrying two cameras and I'm photographing the ground glass of the camera but at the same time I'm using the solar eclipse motif so like in the olden days where people put a piece of cloth over their head with a large format camera I fashioned a, a solar eclipse um, form um, which corresponds to that so that's uh, I'm going around in like this hooded figure, this kind of spectre uh, around Wakefield. So that's one body of work that I'll be making. Another one is where I'll be working inside a large format camera. So I'm using lots of transparent materials and I'm enjoying watching the light go through, go through that. Um, so this kind of evocative space yeah, within that. I do like residences in general, you know, um, and I, um, when I left college, I remember still thinking I needed some more development, and residences offer this kind of um, support, you know, in, in many ways, and I really like that form. I like what the art house represents, you know, that they, the support that they give in, in terms of a studio, uh, in terms of mentoring as well, and also with, with, with you guys, you know, this is a, a, an offshoot of a residency which I've never taken part in before. And that kind of exposure, I think all artists kind of very appreciative. I think the real, reality of being an artist, as you probably know, is there's other things which take up your life, you know, and, and this concentration of, of making, of thinking and of practicing um, will, I hope, really push these two bodies of work for me. It's been short and I think time um, you feel the effects of time as soon as you come here. Um, it was 
I think it's a few days, just under a month, and I've, I really felt uh, a weight of it on my shoulders and having to um, think how the work's going to develop, if the work's going to develop. But um, it's been good because it's forced you to make decisions which you probably wouldn't make so quickly in, in your own lifetime of, of practicing, you know. So that concentration of something, that condensing of, of time, I think it, it really, it has helped. Yeah, it has helped. You know, residencies are quite a, a rarefied thing, you know, um, to do and to get. You know, especially something like a residency like this, because I consider this a, a proper residency. You know, there are different types of residencies with the types of support you get here. You know, it's, it is, um, it is a valuable part of the residency landscape, I think, in the UK. I think what Sean said about being a, a, an alumni of the art house, I think that's, that's exciting as well because it does feel like a place of potential, um, the art house, and um, I, I hope to keep tabs with the art house and see um, where we can find um, connections in the future.